guys, it's Kay. So I'm here with another unboxing video. Um, today we're doing the new FL Sun Castle Delta. Uh, this version comes pre-assembled. Um, so I've never had a pre-assembled printer before. It's clearly not fully built. Uh, when you see the box, you'll know right away it's not a um, it's not a Delta <laughs> or a, a shaped box. So let's go ahead and jump right in. I wanted to show you guys what pre-assembled looks like. I'm pretty curious for myself. So unlike the um, the Cartesian I got from FL Sun, uh, that came in a separate box from Amazon. This one didn't. So taste the little heavier duty. There we go. All right, so nice foam here. That's always good to see. All right. Looks like these are just, I'm not going to un, they've got some sort of adhesive on them. I don't know if they're double-sided adhesive sheets. I'm not sure. Um, I will note this one here looks like it was smushed into some, um, some bolts or something. So that'll, I hope it's not ruined or anything. So we'll check that out later. I'll, I'll let you guys know how that goes. But they look like adhesive sheets. Here is the heated bed, so everything is already on it. Look at this. All the wires are already wrapped, which is <laughs> that's great. I don't want to. I don't have to wrap any wires. Looks like I'm gonna try and get all of this out of here. Here's the power cord. Ooh, I might have to put an adapter on that. I'll have to check. I, I don't know. Looks like I might have to. here. Try not to cause any damage, especially because it's, oh, it's heavy. <laughs> All right, so it already has the bed on it. It's already wired. And, oh, look at that. Power supply and motors and everything. The, um, the touch screen. The touch screen is right there in the front. So, it is a little small, but... I mean, that's fine, it's just a screen. Uh, and what fell out was just one of the, uh, the cords to the screen, so that's fine. All right, this, I'm gonna take a guess and say it's probably the hot end. Yup. So it's got a bunch of belts wrapped around it. I don't, <laughs> and some, some other parts. Oh, this looks like it's for a fan to direct the fan flow. 3D printed. All right, so this is more wrapped wires, which is great, but it's all pretty much assembled. Um, got these little brackets here, so it looks like the belts are already pre-cut and pre-attached, which is great. Here's the other end, and it, uh, the hot end itself has folded up inside there, so it'll flip around. Fans are already on there. Everything looks to be pretty good. I bet I'll get this together in no time at all because it's it's pretty much done. It looks like so. This is going to be the top. Let's see here. Oh goodness. Easy way to get this out. There we go. Okay. All right. So looks like this is the extruder here. Uh, end stops are already attached. And here, that's for that's for the filament. So the filament is mounted sideways, sideways on the top. This is a full roll of PLA. That's pretty cool. A full size roll. Um, it's clear, which is also pretty cool. I've never printed anything clear, but I've been wanting to get some, so that works out. Uh, there is a loose screw <laughs> that came off the top. Um, but, I mean, I guess I'll figure out where it went. <laughs> and that's pretty much it. We have, these are the sides, sides for it. Underneath that is a packet of rods, just a bunch of rods. And um, 
here are the sides so that it looks nice. There's there's three of them there. And let's see here. Lastly, an Allen key and a bunch of zip ties, some washers, some plastic washers, and there is just like with the uh, the FL Sun Cube, it comes with the SD to USB adapter and an SD card full of stuff already on it. So that's it. Everything is pretty much together. I'll probably get it together in no time. Um, I'll let you guys know. I'll have a review out on that as soon as I'm done with it. So thanks for mo so much for watching. I'll see you guys when it's done.